Seems like we have a ton of artillery, though. God damn. That's a, that's a lot of artillery. We don't need transport planes for anything right now. We just need infantry equipment to give to the lads. That's about it. Oh yeah, we have a fair amount that need to actually be handed to the lads. Yeah, that makes sense. Actually give them to uh, to whoever. Oh, sure, was annexed? Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, I don't think that was any any different from what would actually happen. The uh, the only strange thing is that it's it's March of thirty nine, and I don't think I don't think Germany's actually you know going for it yet. Um, they've done Sudet and Lend. They've definitely done the first Vienna award and the Ch fate of Czechoslovakia, but um, they might actually be going for Danzig or War next, which would be interesting. That they actually do something slightly more historical than, you know, maybe opposing Hitler. That's something I've seen them done, which is crazy. Um, still have a lot of communist and democratic ideology here. I'm hoping at some point that might actually come up with something interesting. Who knows? Maybe. Um, let's get ourselves some more industry. I like industry. Industry's fun. I think we're about to finish our next uh, focus of collective farms. We don't want to see what Japan's working on now. No national focus. Please choose one. Please choose one. Please choose one. Please choose one. Bomber modernization. Oh my god, you guys are never having that civil war. Oh my god, okay. Um, might want to just grab it ourselves. Okay, you know what? We're going to keep doing the German focus things. Close the ties with Germany. Maybe we can get Alexander von Falkenhausen as, uh, as one of those good old generals, which would be good. He has, he's an expert on division attack. Bill is chief of army, okay. Um, division attack plus 10%. So what's the difference? They're both experts of what they do. I'm not seeing the... I'm so confused. What's what's the difference? Division attack or division attack? There's just literally no change between the two. Why would I... Why did I do that focus? I am so, so confused right now. Yeah, okay. That sounds good, I guess. So the underground focus or the underground workshops are actually military, interestingly enough. Okay. Alright then. We're making enough divisions... You know, for the meantime. It's a fair number, actually. Waiting for that, uh, you know, communist uprising in Japan to happen. Which I'm sure will work because that's one of the points of Cast the Die. Fascist supporters start a civil war. Um, Nihon Kyo Santu becomes a ruling party. Public elections will not be held. Capture Tokyo will end the Civil War quickly. Menkukuo becomes free, Menchukuo becomes free. Oh, we become free from that. Okay, after this next focus, I think that's what we're doing. We're definitely gonna have to do that then. Yeah, okay. So I've been doing this all wrong. Surprise, surprise. Yeah, congratulations me. I've been doing this wrong, apparently. Huh. Oh well. Oh well. What we really, really need right now is, uh, is a lot of people. We're going to need a lot of men right now, actually. So we're going to get as many people as we can. Sort of stuffed into the army. So when we clear the civil, the civil War, we just need to sort of sit there and defend until we have enough men to exist, maybe? I don't know what else to say. We need a lot of people. That's what I, that's what I have to say. So after giving Falkenhausen, um, citizenship, what we're gonna have to do is, yeah, declare the independence war. And that's what we're gonna have to do. Okay, so two more days. Okay, they have citizenship, I don't care. Uh, we're gonna go immediately for independence war. Don't care what Japan's taking. Okay, sure, approach the young officers, good, do that, good, 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 whatever, do that. Do that if you want, I don't care. Um, what we need right now is just tons of people. And I realize you have tons of people too, 151 divisions, ugh. A lot more manpower than I do, but at the same time, 
we need this done, so. Speaking of getting things done, we can either get... I, I don't really see the difference between having Alexander von Falkenhausen and not. We'll take him because he's cool. I don't know. There's no real reason, so might as well make up a, a terrible reason for it. Speaking of uh, terrible reasons for doing things, we're just going to deploy a whole bunch of guys at once. We need men on the field like right now, so that's what we're doing. Uh, we also need new equipment. We're not making that much a day. When the Independence War starts, we're going to gather a whole bunch of things, but in the meantime, we just need a lot of people. So we're just going to keep making divisions. And eventually, they're going to have enough stuff to just be deployed regularly. We need men. We don't necessarily need guns, you know? But, like, we need people. Right? That's how the theory goes, at least. They'll have full infantry equipment when the war starts. We just need them on the front line right now. So when the war starts, they'll have something, at least. So, uh, yeah. Their attack against me will be worse for... Mm-hmm. Hold on. Uh, Japan gains ammunition, storage, and Manchuria, which grants Manchuko attack bonus against country minus 40%. Machuguo, defense bonus against country. Oh, okay. So for 90 days, they're just... Wait, hold on. Something just happened here. Ooh. Oh, is that happening? Oh, is it happening? What's happening? Hold on. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's happening. I think it's happening now. War with Japan... Is at war with Japan. Are we going to see a Chinese United Front? We might. We might see a Chinese United Front pop out of here, but it's actually the People's Front. Okay. So are we going to see the People's Front rise up? It's possible. It could happen. Okay, it's starting to get a little bit interesting now. Our focus is going to complete fairly soon. Okay, it started. It started. Okay. This is going to be a little bit of a, an oof from us. We're going to join, obviously. Um, <clears throat> I'm not going to help them, but we're going to join. This is important. This is now important because uh, the Independence War is going to start soon. Oh, boy. Oh, man. It's about to start. Okay. Let's get these guys, uh, the organization up. It is finally going to start, and um, <clears throat> it's not going to start the way I wanted it to. But it just started. Okay. Uh, first of all, proclaim the Empire. Okay. All right. They're going to create pockets in our, you know, little existence here, which is kind of a problem. Okay, here's what we're going to do. First of all, turn it down a couple of speeds. Second of all, we're going to get cavalry to sort of walk in there. Um, they're out of... More or less everything. Uh, okay, okay. How are we going to how are we gonna manage this? Okay, so these guys, essentially... I need you to sort of rush down Korea. Sort of like that. You know, in a general sort of fashion. And take as much as you can, as quickly as you can. These guys, I want you to... Hold that line, obviously, but uh, at some point you're going to have to take these guys down. So, in fact, what we might have to end up doing is split. There's like no one in Jap and, uh, Japan right now there, uh, as far as I can tell. So, the main people will be there. What's really important is we get half these guys. Split them in half. I'm going to assign them to a, uh, a new line right there. Let's say, hey, go over there. And it will be all these guys over there. Right? Right. Okay. Look at the split, get there as soon as you can. Ensure war for independence. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, I forgot to read it. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna do, um, execute the plan. Boom, there you go. Wonderful. Oh my god, yes, very good. Okay, we're gonna ask France for things. We're going to. Oh my god, yes. He's got a whole bunch of infantry equipment, didn't we? Oh my god, beautiful. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh my god, yes. Okay, this is good. These are, things are going almost exactly as I planned them to. 
almost exactly. Not quite, I have to say, but not, not the worst thing that could have happened. Alright. Okay, so things are going relatively okay. As far as, you know, I want them to. Uh, we just don't want as many... We want as few Japanese people to land on these shores as we can, essentially. Um, so let's try and get this guy to split these guys up. Get a small encirclement there. You know, anything that we can grab. At least, you know, at least something. Okay, things are going... Swimmingly, essentially. That's exactly as I need them to. Okay, nice. Nice! Okay. Feels nice to have your plans work off. Hey, Romania game. Huh. Yo, what's up, Bowler Cat McGee? I've seen you, like, so many months ago, I hardly remember that you guys like to uh, watch my Hoi 4 sometimes. Just pop in more often, you know? Sometimes it gets lonely here. <laughs> but as you can see, my uh, Qing China is actually sort of going to plan. You know, crazily enough, it's insane. But um, soon enough we're going to have a whole bunch of fresh troops. And um, by fresh, I mean extremely fresh and all they have is equipment and no training. But nah, it's whatever. So essentially, we're going to tell these guys, yes, go capture them. Because, you know, they can't defend themselves, which is great. <laughs> ah, yes, 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 yes. Okay, very, very nice. We're going to get these guys there and then we're going to tell them... Fix the uh, fix that situation over there. These guys are very very slowly invading Korea. Oh, we have a gap on the line. We have a gap on the line. Fix that. Fix that immediately, please, if you can. Next day and eight hours. Next twenty hours. Okay. We don't need that right now. Um, we need to get more people on the front line immediately. There you go. Okay. Yeah. This is this is the mess. This is a big old mess. Okay. Yes. Make a new army. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. No, hold on. Uh, these guys. Make a new armor. These guys. Um, get your old guy back. Who is he? He was this guy, right? Yeah, okay. Okay, we're good. Uh, we're going to get another guy. Who is... I don't know. Yeah, sure. You're going to do that. Uh, you're all going to be under this guy. He has everything sorted out. We have... One army doing things over there. We have one army who needs to get their stuff back together. Chill. Um, yeah, that's just sort of going to be your plan, maybe. Sure. Okay. And these guys are going to have to help out with uh, that division right there. And they're going to also have roughly the same plan sort of drawn out, you know? Oh, was it a U4? Oh my god, I am so sorry. I get my Paradox games mixed up so easily. Yeah, it must have been, uh, it must have been a U4. Was it my Congo game, I think? They popped in during? I think so. I believe so. Oh, communist infiltration. Um, no thank you. Why would I have communism in my country? Excuse me. Is the ideology drift? Daily change, nothing. I am confused. We don't want communism right now. That would mess up everything. Anti-communist sweep sounds like it would be great to do. Maybe. It sounds kind of sadistic. Oh, it would be so good to sweep out the communists. <laughs> uh, I don't want to hear it. Okay, so actually, uh, we're going to change this. We're going to change this up a bit. No, we're not, actually. We're going to keep that exactly how it is. We're going to keep that exactly how that is. Okay, um... How is this going? Not great? I assume not. Yeah, no, it's not. It will be going great, I can assure you. It will be doing fine. Actually, it's just a theory of mine. Who knows? It might actually just do terribly and we don't know. But, uh, we're gonna assume it's going fine. We're gonna assume it's gonna be fine. Yeah, it was a Congo game. Eh, I thought so. I don't remember when I finished that game. Or even if I did finish that game. I think I finished it. Maybe I didn't. Who knows? Oh. Okay. Okay, that's a lot of people they have there now. That's a little bit more worrying. Okay, we can... If we push them out of Korea, we can use that to fix everything else, so... If we get everyone in position here. Um, minus 20, minus 50. That is... Sin Division's not done preparing. 
Yeah, okay, I understand that. Okay, sort of chill here, defend. Um, get everyone in their proper positions. Actually, no, it's, it's fine. Uh, as for these guys, you need to sort of get to your positions. Which would be almost prepared. Yeah, it's prepared enough. Vision still preparing and not... Yeah, it's fine. Alright, there you go. It's risky, but it'll be fine. Hopefully. Having a lot of people, maybe, will win. Will win us that, uh, what's going on there? Because I know Japan's going to be working on some stuff called, uh, invading China through sea. That's what they like to do a lot, so. Uh, we'll, I guess, see what's going to go on there. Huh. That was a terrible joke. That was terrible. Okay, let's get some fighters, whatever. Deploy them in uh, Manchuria, maybe. When they deploy, I'll set them down to normal operations, air security, and interception. Deploying eventually? 5th of October. There you go. Yeah, deploy there. They're gonna help, hopefully. They have a lot of bombers, but not a lot of everything else. So, that's fine. Okay, so you guys are not quite doing your thing yet. Okay, we're gonna get you to do that. Yeah, that'll be fine. Um, the next thing you're gonna want to do is... When we get enough, we're gonna want to go to the next level of manpower. So you can continue this war. I don't see why you guys are not trying to sort of encircle that one troop right there, because he's clearly on a fort, that one troop. So being able to encircle him will be huge. Clearly on a fort right now, to level 2, which is not insignificant. I mean, it's not significant, but it's not insignificant. It's not like the Maggie No line here, but, you know. It's uh, something we'd rather not have. So yeah, that's fine. That'll be done when? Three days? So there he goes, let's boost up the speed. Get things done a little bit faster, because let's be honest, this war is not going super fast. We're making our way along decently. I wouldn't say perfectly, but decently. Okay, good. We're going to get these guys to help out there. The cavalry's doing their job, right? I mean, hopefully. You guys help out there, too. Okay, nice. Yeah, um, we're going to need, you know, a lot more, so let's just do that. That also means, unfortunately, we're going to need a lot of steel. France happens a lot of happens to have a lot of steel, so we're going to do that. We're also going to continue along this, right? Yeah, okay, good. Um, let's go with... Advanced machine tools seems like a good idea, actually. We're making 88.84 a day, which is a decent number, right? But uh, yeah, we're definitely going to need a little bit more going on. We're just going to slap down tons of troops. I mean, what do we have right now? 65 divisions? Much more than Senji. Um, offer vassalization is probably going to end up working in the end, because of how, many, how much manpower we're going to end up slapping down. Seems like Korea's coming more to a standstill than anything else, which we don't want. It's happening, guys. It's happening. It is absolutely happening right now. Are we fighting the Japanese People's Republic? No. Oh, we're not at war with those. We're at war with Japan, Japan, not uh, the Japanese People's Republic. Fine. Not what I had planned. Not what, not what I had planned entirely. But in the end, it might be okay. The Japanese People's Republic will be a little bit, well, actually, uh, significantly less powerful. But it means that we're fighting, you know, China alone here. That's an issue. That's a bit of an issue. Okay, uh... They're on our side, aren't they? Oh, never mind. They're not on our side. Okay, yeah, okay, okay, guys, okay. We're at war with both of them now? Yes, we are. Okay. That's cool. Alright, what we're gonna have to do is... Take advantage of the chaos. They're fighting each other while we're fighting them. Okay, so this couldn't have gone much better. And then got better. Somehow. Hmm. -mm. Um. Yeah, continue doing your things. 
Yeah, continue doing that. That's fine. The people was capitulated. Nice, thank you. Since they're going to be fighting each other and us, that's going to make us much, much easier to invade them. Um, who's assigned to this, actually? All these divisions here, right? You know what assigned to that army? Move, maybe? Thank you, okay. That's good. Divisions got split up, making it easier for us to conquer them. We just have to hold off China for a little while, which isn't the hardest thing to do, really. I mean, hell, you could just, like, probably stop and just sort of chill there. Probably. Actually, no, let's continue along that path. They're, uh... Not reinforcing there at the very least. Going over the river is probably a good idea. Unless we start to fail, and then it's not a good idea. That's fine. Okay, now we have good stuff happening in Manchuria. We do need some superiority in Korea will help us get rid of uh, their stuff in Korea first and then continue on. That sounds like a good idea to me. So, uh, the blue divisions here, right? We want them to do the same thing. Uh, just hop down there. Continue going along there as well. Okay. You guys are doing what I need you to, right? Yes, you are. Okay. Good, 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 good. Things are working out in my favor totally unexpectedly. Which is good. Uh, we're going to get one cavalry to go down there because cavalry are faster. Oh, there are people down there. Okay, it's a good thing I brought other people. Right, yeah, it's a port. Of course, they'd be bringing more people in. That's fine. Not an issue. Okay. China, stop. China, stop doing that, please. China, please. They keep walking in. Okay, we have to fix that. We can fix that. We can fix that, but it's going to take a couple of seconds for us to react to that while we do uh, other things. Let's get support equipment because I don't see why not. These guys are pushing pretty well, uh, but we're going to have to ask them to push better. Um, German right to clear war in France. Yeah, that happens occasionally. Once these guys are done, we're going to have to ask these guys to... No. That's not what I ask you to do. I ask of these guys to go do that. Did not ask this entire front to go do, to go do that. So don't don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, stay there. Stop. 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 Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Stay. Good boy. Stay. Okay. I need artillery. Uh, these guys are. In do we not want to need them to? Let's uh, bring them back down to normal. Need more artillery. Yeah, okay, we're going to need a lot more artillery. Let's bring them up to there. Uh, that means we have more than enough than we, than we, uh, than we have there. Okay, there we go. Uh, we do need some uh, tungsten, though, so let's ask British Malaya for it. Why not? These guys are done, right? Okay, good. Uh, we're actually going to have to have everyone there assigned to that army. Or uh, to, to there, you know. To get rid of there. These guys are going to aggressively push still. Because they can, essentially. Oh. Um. I think not, actually. I have to say, I'm going to have to say no to that. Because, I mean, what would that do for me? Literally nothing good. Yeah, that's going to have to be a no for me. I know you guys are severely weakened after your civil war, so I'm going to use that to my full advantage. Take over China and continue going. Sounds good to me, and you don't have an option, so just, you know, whatever. Uh, all of these troops... Yeah, just go do that. Take that land, then we'll travel to the bottom of Korea. Take that for ourselves. And we're holding back the Chinese, you know, kind of, somewhat, maybe? I mean, is it the whole front, or is it just 
Nope, it's China and the People's Front. That's it. So Japan is at war with three parts of China, which we're going to ask for vassalization slightly later on. Okay, we can do army regrouping. Sounds like a good idea right now. Oh, right, no, we're going to talk about our uh, conscription. Yeah, let's do that. So we need more men, actually. We also need more equipment to give to our men. That all that good thing, you know. That's important, too. Then when you, are, when you guys are done there, I want you to sweep down, finish off Korea for me, and we can keep going. Oh my god, I'm so relieved this started working out in the end, because I thought that a whole bunch of things would go crazy. I mean, not gonna lie, things did go crazy, yeah. I can, I can agree with that statement there. I mean, there's no one in Pyongyang, just go take it, sure. I mean, not like there's anyone important in Pyongyang right now, in real life. That was a bad joke. Okay, let's get everyone 19 divisions. Really? That's all we have? Okay, that's fine. Not a problem. Get those 19 divisions just, you know, do whatever they're doing. Hmm. Who is that? That's not the Japanese People's Republic. That looks like... Is that Thailand? No, that can't be Thailand. That's Siam. Um, why am I fighting Siamese troops? That doesn't make sense. Why am I fighting Siamese troops? But they say the Japanese People's Republic, but that's clearly the flag of Siam. That is very clearly the flag of Siam. Okay. <sighs> Make a screenshot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to ask people later about this bug. Report it. Yeah. Okay. It's probably just a bug. Luxembourg joins the Allies. Things are going oddly normal in in Europe. I mean, France, you know, we might see the French Commune exist. That'd be interesting. Italy, still really fascist. UK, still not fascist. Wait, I want to see what, King, what Canada did. Um, Canada went with strength in the Commonwealth. Well, that's boring. Darn it, Canada, that's boring. How about Australia? Policy of appeasement. That's boring. New Zealand? Really? You're all doing the boring thing? Strengthen the Commonwealth? Oh my god. Okay, how about the Raj? That's just the Great War. Line of the Great War. Indianization. You guys aren't going for fascism, are you? We haven't decided yet. They might. It would be really interesting to see at least someone in the Commonwealth go fascist. That'd be interesting. It's like a wet dream for me to see some AI go fascist, like Canada or something. Like, specifically because it makes no sense and has no good purpose. That's literally why. It just, this looks funny to me. Like, what are you gonna do, fascist Canada? Like, you're gonna do nothing. Like, just chill. Chill there for a second, but at least it's fun to watch, right? It's, okay, it's a little bit mean. I live in Canada, though, alright? It's fine. You can't, you can't be angry at me. Uh, let's build some convoys. Convoys are fun. Oh, something big must be happening. Yes. You guys are all refusing. Oh my god, please. Okay. Two people submitted, two people refused. God damn. Well, that sucks, dude. Alright. Um, I was hoping for more people to accept, but apparently not. Okay, we're gonna ask you guys, because that's gonna be fun. Um... Oh, they to participate in the wars automatically, so you guys are at war with uh, Yunnan and Shenji. Sounds fine. Um, excuse me? You want me to join the Pact of Rome? I don't know what's going on. But I don't think I really want to. Yeah, no. No, we're not doing that. People's Front is apparently including Japan now. That's kind of concerning. Hungary, if you reform or like you restore the Austro-Hungarian Austro Empire, um, by all means, okay. You guys did not just sign a white peace. Okay, no, you did. Someone just took sign a white peace with someone else. Well, here's from Italy. Cool, cool. Code artillery, nice. So you guys are being a little bit helpful, if you know, not a ton. Um, we're getting the manpower, right? 
Oh yeah, we are. Oh yeah, we are. Beautiful. Okay. Are we getting pushed out of China? I think we are getting pushed out of China. That's what it looks like to me. Okay, so once we finish up with Japan here, we're going to have to do that, you know, solid push. Um, you guys right here don't have a push line. Okay. We're going to clear all those orders, um, and then unclear them. We're going to say, fight up to there. These guys who are also there and do not have orders, I'm going to say, fight up to there. You guys need to get into positions. And actually attack, because you've just sort of been defending there and it's not been, you know, actually too successful. And we're going to have to change that. Oh, at least things were going well so far. Manual orders are not really my thing. I like to let the AI decide what it's doing, even if it'll end up, you know, killing me in the end. But for now, things are actually not doing too poorly, interestingly enough. With our uh, little puppets doing some some work, not much, but you know something, at least. Get these divisions going in there. These are oh, very very clearly Siam troops, and I don't understand them. I don't understand how they're there. But I don't really care that much. Yeah, pop yourselves in there. Is that a war between? Not a war, but a battle between two navies of. Imperial Japan and non-Imperial Japan. People's Republic of Japan. Which is really, really funny to say in my mouth. But, uh, okay. We gotta sign these guys to the same front, and we're gonna give them a more yeah, aggressive order. You know. Take this, maybe. That sounds fine to me. We're gonna do a full frontal assault against- Whoa, 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 Is that Switzerland way too many years early? That is Switzerland way too many years early. Is that France and you haven't even killed them? Who are you guys at war with? You guys haven't even killed the Netherlands yet? The Netherlands pushing into Germany? I'm so confused right now and I don't even know what to say. Um, at least Poland's dying, you know, like usual. Not without taking Danzig first. Or, uh, East Prussia. Like they're not supposed to. But okay. These guys need to make their way over there, and then they're going to need to help us out a lot. Is that? That's not the Soviet Union. That is the Communist China. Yes, it is. We're not at war with Soviets, right? No, we're not at war with Soviets, but they probably sent uh, guys over, to be honest. Like, yeah, Soviet Union, there's... Give them volunteers across the area. Definitely sending them volunteers, aren't they? Oh, yeah. People's Republic of Japan. Um, somehow not, okay, so the People's Republic of Japan is getting them, but, okay, okay, that's not what I thought, that's not what I thought was happening, okay, you guys, you guys have railroads, right, or do we just not have enough infrastructure for railroads, I assumed we'd have, like, railroads if nothing else, but like, not even railroads, I guess, that's cool. Engineer companies are very good to have, so we're going to grab a couple of those. You guys are not happy because some divisions are not in the proper places. Okay, you'll be fine. As well as those guys, you'll, you'll be fine. We're pushing back though, right? Yeah, we are, definitely. Okay. These guys need to get in position. Oh my god, it's an hour and five minutes already? I li literally thought I was at 45 minutes. Oh my god, wow. Time flies when you're... Restoring the Qing Dynasty of China. Right then, that means we're going to have to put a pause in right here. We're going to have to continue this war later on. And hopefully, you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. Because my plans are actually working out this time. And it's super exciting. But unfortunately, since we're just over an hour, we're going to have to put a cut in right here. And I hope you guys are going to come back and watch the next time I stream. Or the next time I upload. And as always, have a fantastic day.